Good evening everyone in the UK and today I'm going to be reviewing a another custom version of Windows 7 and that custom version of Windows 7 is called Windows Vieira. Windows Vieira is a custom version of Windows 7 created by Windows Siena and I have yet to review it so let's see what it's like. I'm looking forward to seeing what it is. So let's just um, locate the ISO, which I think, yeah, here it is. Let's locate the ISO and install it for this Windows Vera. I'm gonna make this in the same style as last time. And I'm gonna make the hard disk size 40 gigabytes. Right, let's customize the hardware. Hopefully this will make it install faster. Probably not, but you know, let's see. So, unlike Windows Ocean, we've got the standard starting Windows animation as seen in Windows 7. That's, that's alright though. It would be nice if they changed that. Unless it's changed once it's fully installed. Oh, here, oh wow, they did change the background. That's, it's a greenish like Windows Vista background. I, li I like that. The Windows Vista background's already green, but they've taken the green of the Windows Vista background and made it more green, if you know what I mean. So the areas that were blue are now green, a lime-like colour. Oh, oh, I know what I did wrong, do excuse me. I made a slight error. And that error is... I forgot to um, get rid of easy install. I really hate easy install, easy install is terrible. So what we're going to do is we're going to get rid of easy install, which is this floppy disk right here, because it just, un it makes the setup experience for Windows unattended, so the user doesn't have to enter out any information. I don't like that, I really don't. I like being able to look at the setup, the Windows installation environment, you know, to a full extent. So. Let's just redo this, wait for it to load. Yep, we've already discussed the background. Oh, okay. So, it just says Windows. The branding just says Windows instead of Windows Vieira. I wonder why that is. It might be to avoid copyright and all that. You know what? I might actually do that in my Vienna transformation packs. I might actually change that to Windows, you know, to avoid copyright, because making custom versions of Windows is in a very, very, very grey area, and I mean in dark grey area, it is, well, yeah, it's very, um, it's not, it's not recommended, so, so to speak, so yeah, I might actually do that. Oh, I like how they changed that to a, um, Vieira all, but I do like that, that's very nice. Once Windows Vieira has installed, I shall be back. So here we are at the out of box experience, and it's, there's nothing changed here unfortunately. The background is still Windows 7, and the branding is also still Windows 7. But, there's always time for change. But at least they've um, changed the theme. I can tell the next button is like a yellowy colour. I like that. It's very nice. So let's just... Oh, and they've um, also changed the progress bar, which is nice. So let's see what we get as soon as, you know, we've all, we're all set up. Oh, wow. That's funny. The log on background is literally just the Windows 7 one at the moment. But again, this is only a beta version of the theme. And yeah, it seems like it's very far from the final. Oh wow, that's nice. I like the background. The background looks nice. Oh look. Never mind what I said, there is a comment, I mean not, not comment, there is a folder here called Files to Complete. And it looks like I've got to make all these changes in order for the theme to work. But before I do that, I'm going to install VMware Tools. Oh, and there's also a readme file here. 
This build is not final. Yep. This is, yeah, incomplete at the moment. Oh yeah, and um, very nice of him to include my channel. Yeah, thank you very much. I very much appreciate that. Yeah, thank you, Windows Sienna. So, here's the boot screen. Quite a nice boot screen, although the animation is a little choppy, but you know, that can be changed in the future. But besides that, I do like the colours, and I really like the logo on wallpaper, and I quite like the branding as well. So, here's the background, the Windows Vieira background. It's quite a nice background, actually. It is a bit blurry, but I like the design. It's very nice choice of colours. I really like the start button as well. The start button looks really nice. And, um, yeah, what else is there? So let's have a look at the Explorer. And the Explorer looks pretty nice as well. I like the yellow buttons. They're very nice. And I like the theme. The theme looks very nice. I like the colours, the text. I'm liking that. So let's have a look at the control panel. Let's redo that. Ah, there we go. Here's the changed applet sidebar. That's looking very nice. I really do like that. I really like the applet sidebar along with the branding. The branding looks very nice. Although the branding here still says Windows 7 Ultimate. But again, this theme is in still in development. It's still not quite finished yet. This is not a final version, so there's again still room for change. So now we're gonna rate this computer to show off the this animation here. Yep, I really I quite like the animation. That is a very nice animation. I like it. I like the colours. I like the the orange, the yellow, the green, and that slight bit of blue at the end there is very nice. And I like the yellow cancel buttons. They're very nice. It's very good. I like the progress bar and everything. I like the close bar. I like the Windows buttons up here, they're very nice, and I like these arrows over here, they're very nice too. So yeah, this is um, this is about it really, this concludes my, oh well, no, we need to play the startup sound. Yeah, that's quite a nice startup sound, I quite like that, it's very good. So yeah, I think now this concludes my review of Windows Vieira, and you know what, I think it's quite good. But like Windows Sienna said, it's far from completion, and for what it is, I think in terms of development so far, I think it's doing pretty good. I think the final version of Windows Vieira is going to be looking pretty good, so yeah, I think you guys should give Windows Vieira a try. And I think you guys like it once it's reached completion, so let's just shut down this VM and call it a day. I, I quite like this. So yeah, that, that concludes my review. Go check it out. Go subscribe to Windows Sienna, the creator of this, because yeah, Windows VR is pretty good. I quite like it. So yeah, see you soon everyone.